Good morning, Cyber Traders. Welcome to Coronavirus Black Monday. Good to see you all. Ben, good to see you. Jerry, Dennis, good to see you all. There is no better place than being in a cyber group right now. Okay, I, 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 you know what? You don't have to worry about going anywhere. You don't got to rush and do everything you to do. There's no better place. There's no safer place. There's no cleaner, no, you know, nothing better than the cyber group room, would you say? You guys all agree? It is just incredible. All right, so listen, I, you know, if you hopefully some of you guys have been watching. Um, I don't know if you guys are on my uh, Instagram account, but like uh, every morning, once in a while, I try to post a on my way to work every morning and do a quick uh, post on my Instagram and I also post on YouTube and, and, and Facebook but use my Instagram uh, trying to give you guys a little heads up what the game plan for the morning is you guys all know that I do start around 730 in the morning two hours before the market opens up and uh, I'll tell you I couldn't sleep all night I mean I woke up like four or five times uh, regarding about what was going on with the market. I mean, yesterday you had a, I, and listen, I'm not here to broadcast the news for you. You probably already did that already. You probably been glued to the TV and you need to, I mean, need not need to know that they closed New York city schools, which by the way, is that is absolutely historic. Uh, they might even, and, and I'm going to tell you what the whole thing behind it, that, which is what I think is going to happen. Uh, I want to tell you a little bit more about what is going to be really good to trade and what's going to be good. But I'm just telling you right now, before we get started, there is no better place and there is no better business than being in, in being a trader right now. Listen, um, you know, I can't, I can't fit in my, in my Instagram post, but listen, you know, the first responders, okay. They train, they train, they train the firemen, the police department, you know, everyone, the first responders practice to do everything to deal with some catastrophes, whatever the, you think they expected there to be a 9-11. OK, now what are they supposed to do? Not do anything. They're like, I I'm not prepared for this. They're trained for that. OK, you know, people, uh, our, our veterans, our, our, our people in our military, do you think they want to go to the, go to war? You think they prepare for it? They just prepare for it, you know, and we just hope, you know, prepare for the uh, hope for the best and prepare for the worst. This is what you were trained to do. You are a traitor. OK, you are now stepping into one of the things that this is this is our 9-11 this is our war this is this is what you train what to do i told you you know unfortunately be careful what you wish for because it's going to happen and guess what this is what you train this is your opportunity so it's time to you know put your head down get into the trading room and and get ready to trade because this is where you're going to make all your money you know like it or not forget you know if you want to worry about what what to do and feel sorry for these and that listen you're going to miss the run this is what this is your job OK, period. You know, this is all this is your job. You got to get ready to trade. You got to put your head down. You're in cash. And let me tell you something. And which is what a lot of traders. And if you notice, a lot of people that, that teach or, or do what we do, something that they don't do that I do. OK, because they don't know how to do it. They're not scalpers. This is a scalping market. OK, scalping means you get in and out of trades. If you don't know how to scalp, by the way, if you're a student of Cybertrain University, I did a scalping course. It's it's actually in your portal page. Look up scalp, but don't do it now. You know, you got class today. But if you want to learn and understand the whole scalp mirror, the theory, you know, are you buying? Is it, you know, what fate, what level you buying the stock at? All that stuff, fate, level one, two, three, four, five. You know, I need to teach you the class. It's in there. But this is how you scalp. OK. A lot of people are not scalpers. They're not day traders. They're swing traders. That's what they are. They're swing traders, and they literally have no idea, you know, because they're waiting for their indicators to kick in and all that good stuff. So I'm not looking to go on a rampage or, you know, whatever. But I'm just telling you that this is a scalping market, and this is what you have to do. You got to think quick, and, you know, you got to make the money quick and just be happy that you made it, and that's it. The only thing that separates us from them is that you got to be in cash. You got to be in cash. I know some of you are looking at some swing trades, and a lot of people are still trying to pick the bottom. You know what? We saw what happened on Friday. President came out, market ran 1,500 points. 1,500 points. Now, if you guys watched my video, actually, if you go on our website, we actually we showcased it when I was on NASDAQ. And the bit, number one thing that they were asking me is like, Fausto, when do you think the bottom is? I'm going to repeat it, and I'm going to keep repeating it again. Okay? 
And believe me, I think we're almost there. I really think we're almost there regardless of what you hear about TV or even all the other analysts. I'm telling you, I think we're almost there. How do you know we're almost there? When you got the worst of the worst of the worst of the worst news, the worst of the news, and we don't go any lower, that's the bottom. Okay? So what's the worst of the worst? They closed New York City schools. They closed the restaurants. And I predict probably in the next 24 to 48 hours, we're going to go to a complete lockdown in the United States. To me, that's the worst news. And then we'll see how the market. But I had a meeting with Josh this morning. We always have our morning meetings to prepare you guys regarding what's going on. I could tell you this. Please keep in mind, they are not shutting the stock market down. They can't. We're not in New York uh, restaurant, okay? This is a global um, financial market. They will never close down the, the currency market. They will never close down the futures. They're going to close the New York Stock Exchange probably the virus, but they are not going to close the market down. And then that's and there's no better place than be locked in your home, in confinement, in the trading room. <laughs> that's when you will have fun. Now let's talk about what happened on Friday. I mean, I really don't even know where to start, but. Listen, there were so many great movers that were moving, OPK. You know, I, I personally, I, I can tell you the truth now. You're probably going to hear a lot of this stuff going on. I think the Corona stocks are finished. All the Corona stocks, I mean, you might get a couple here and there that might make some pops. I personally think they're done, okay? The news is out. Remember, buy on rumors, sell on news. You know, they're all fighting to get this and that. So be careful of trading some of these Corona stocks, okay? These pharmaceutical stocks, all that stuff. Um, I would focus more on scalping and day trading. And a lot of them, you could see what's going on. Some of you guys did pretty well already. Um, you, some of you already did pretty well on, uh, you, you traded uh, Royal Caribbean. And it's funny, if you look, at the, you look at them, they're starting to pop a little bit, you know? So, I mean... I know they locked the market. The Dow is halted because it broke through the 5%. But if you notice here, 8 o'clock this morning, the stock was $27, already ran to 30 Scalp, 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 scalp. That is your that is your model right now. Don't worry about picking the bottom. Just scalp. If you want to pick the bottom, you buy a company right now. I'm just telling you right now, you got a deal for the 1,000 points up to 2,000 points down, whatever it is. You know, there's some great, great buys out there. If you're looking for, you know, six months, a year down the road, you know what? You're going to have to deal with some of the headaches, and you have to deal with it. But right now, as day traders, it's a scalping market. There's so many of them that are moving. Um, you know, play got crushed. I mean, this one's taking a big uh, correction. Look at 45 down to 10. Uh, like I said, all the – uh, all the cruise companies are like all over the place. They're taking a little bit of hit, but they're coming back a little bit. Uh, oil and transportations, all of them. So all the ETFs are all over the place. I mean, look at this. Thing. This what's this down 70, 72 percent. I mean, these things made these big pop. That doesn't really. I don't know what the hell that is. But a lot of these stocks got destroyed, and they did come back. CHK. All these things. Where's a uh, gush? Whew. Yeah, gush. I'll tell you really, really quick. Very interesting stock. Really holding pretty strong at that 50 cent level. So I would keep a close eye on that. Looks long term play. That might be safe. Uh, but listen, one. Uh, I know I want to get right to get you guys get ready to trade because we're going to have a really exciting market. Couple of stocks I do want to kind of tell you. What do I personally think is going to be a good buy? Well, think about this for a second. What companies are actually benefiting right now during to the coronavirus, other than speculation on which company is going to come with a, a cure for the virus? Think about it. What? Who's actually making money in this market? Does anybody know? Think about it. Who's really doing well? Who's profiting from this? No, nah, not hedge funds. William, congratulations. Hit the nail right in the head. You want a good buy? Food, stanalizers. Keep an eye on the grocery stores. Unfortunately, Perel is not a public company. <laughs> All right. Um, toilet paper. You know, can't find a damn anywhere. Okay. You might have to go buy a bidet. So listen, keep an eye. If, you, if you're a fan of like a Costco or a BJ's, if you notice, they really haven't gone down a lot. 
Okay, look look at look at the move on Costco, 160, 180 to two to 320. I, I I'm telling you, I'm a huge fan of Costco. I max out my $500 check. I get it every year, so you know how much you could actually imagine what I spend there. Um, wish I could have bought it, you know, when I when I could have, but you know I didn't because I bought something else. But uh, but here's your opportunity to buy some of these stocks. There are some great companies out there. BJ's also, if you look at them, oops, typed in a wrong window. Same thing. They really haven't came down a lot, um, down to 21, right around here, all time, all time lows. So if there's anything you want to look that I think are going to come out with some huge, major, great earnings announcements, I think those are probably your two best, uh, best bets out there to kind of be focused on. Uh, uh, is Costco at 355 all day long? Listen, you know, I'm just a trader, okay? I'm just a trader, and I know when I walked in that place, there was nothing in the store. Um, I mean, you heard the president talk about on Friday, people are buying four to five times more food, you know what I mean, out there. I remember, I could tell you this, Hurricane Sandy, you know what benefited from Hurricane Sandy? Okay, Home Depot, Lowe's. Uh, the the company that uh, the the uh, the company that makes uh, the generators they killed it okay a year down the road the thing was almost tripled in value so listen what did it, Generac right yeah, there you go killed it killed it okay so I remember going to Home Depot you couldn't even find an outlet you know people were trying to uh, rig up their uh, generators and and the, the electric and all this it's just unbelievable so anyway. Uh, so if you're looking at something that I know they were trying to find the bottom because some of these companies got killed because of the, the airlines and what's happening and travel and this and that. But um, but the food companies are killing it right now. So I'll keep an eye on that. Stop and shop. Uh, is that a shop is actually a stock? Yeah, uh, no, Shopify. Wrong one. <laughs> MRNA is running up. Yeah, it's got a little bit of a pop right there. But guys, once again, if you want to keep an eye on some really good buys, uh, keep an eye on what, what's actually what, what's happening with this. But the, the food industry is going to get killed. Listen, um, like I told you when we first started, there's no better place to be than in the trading room right now. You're stuck at home. I predict within the next 24 to 48 hours, the United States is probably going to be on full lockdown. Uh, don't worry about us, guys. Cyber Trade University is all set up. Everyone's going to be willing to be remote from home. We, everyone's all set up. We're prepared for this. We've been prepared um, since Hurricane Sandy. So we're all set up. We're going to be we're going to be full blow. Class is going to go on. You guys are going to have no problems. Uh, just uh, you know what? You're worrying about baseball, Ken. You're worrying about uh, everything, uh, hockey. Listen, everyone's going to want to want to trade. I can tell you this. My phone has blew up. Everyone's like, I have friends of mine that are brokers at some of the top brokerage firms in the industry, and they're calling me up because they're not traders. And it says, Fausto, what do you think? You think this is the bottom? I feel like I'm at the racetrack. Hey, what are you betting on? What are you betting on? You know, it's like, trust me, guys, there's no better place than being here. We're going to make a lot of fun. Just remember, you, remember, this is what you paid for here for Cyber Trade University to help you what to do, and that's to learn how to trade. So let's go out there and work together like a team. So don't forget, guys, um, one, one last thing before we go. Big, big announcement. I wanted to just remind you, I am going to be doing in a big event at 11 o'clock this morning with Bookmap, okay? Uh, it's going to be an exciting one. You guys want to know about Level 4? You know what? We're one of the most exclusive uh, uh, online uh, training schools out there that are, are showcasing that platform. You do not want to miss it. We'll give you the link in there. Make sure you register for it. And, I'm gonna, we're gonna, and there's going to be a lot of people in there. I know it's going to be a pretty big, big event, um, especially everyone loves the new level four. You know, you saw me on NASA talk about book, uh, total view, uh, book map's going to be fun. So look forward to seeing you guys all there. All right, guys, good luck, happy trading, and uh, be safe. We'll start commentating by the next 10 minutes, all right?